all season, especially the second half. And, you know, we, we rely on that guy a lot. In the first game, you kind of got agitated toward Acuna, and today there was a little more. That's, how do you know that? I guess I'm just asking from an outside perspective. How do you know that he's totally locked in on, on the next batter huh? rather than emotional? Yeah, I mean, I, I really can't answer that. You know, I'd. I think you know, being in the league as long as we've had, we've been, you know, we know how to lock it in pretty well. Um, you know, being in situations, Carlos was in the playoffs just when I was, you know, so we have that playoff experience. We have, you know, six years under our belt, so you know, it's about understanding. You know, with time, you start to figure out how to lock it in. You know, pitch by pitch, hitter by hitter. You mentioned something about what you guys have been through this year, maybe preparing it. Uh, Mac Carpenter said hey, it wouldn't be us if it was any other way where we had our backs to the wall. Do you see that? Uh, Absolutely. You know, it wouldn't be us. Uh, we haven't had it easy all year. It's been like this up and down. Um, you know, you look at the guys in the clubhouse, I mean, we're not bummed out. I mean, we're mad because, we, you know, we're not doing our jobs for Wayno. And, um, you know, we, we kind of gave a, a game away today. And, um, you know, we're going to come back ready to go tomorrow and, and put our best foot forward and, you know, grind. What do you expect from Dakota tomorrow with everything he's done down the stretch and what he's done for you guys? Yeah, this year? I mean, you're going to kind of see a pretty similar approach to how Soroka pitched. I mean, you know, that hard sink, um, you know, a lot of ground balls for us at the middle, so we got to be prepared, ready to go, and, you know, make sure we stay on our toes. I mean, we're going to get a lot of ground balls, a lot of opportunities to make plays and do what we can for him.